大家好，样样嘢都讲智能，口罩都讲究有智能功用，一阵会报道。依家首先讲下疫苗嘅制成同鲨鱼嘅关系。用鲨鱼肝脏内嘅角鲨烯做疫苗助剂，并非新事。环保团体认为，长期宰杀鲨鱼作医疗用途，对自然生态并非理想嘅可持续情况，要作出平衡系一个挑战。李永如报道。二零二零年終於喺一片沉重嘅抗疫氣氛中結束。隨住新冠疫苗嘅研發進度漸見曙光，來年全球喺抗疫路上有望通過注射疫苗更有效防疫。世界上好多新醫學技術嘅誕生，除咗要多得一班勞苦功高嘅醫學家喺學術上作出貢獻之外，根據每個研發項目嘅情況，有時亦需要犧牲動物嚟達到理想嘅醫療效果。除咗利用白老鼠为人类试药之外，仲有鲨鱼体内嘅角鲨烯被用嚟制作疫苗助剂，提高人体免疫效力。根据世界卫生组织网站提供嘅资料显示，角鲨烯最先喺一九九七年被加入一种流感疫苗，每剂疫苗含十毫克嘅角鲨烯。有一个总部位于美国加州嘅鲨鱼保育组织，名叫鲨鱼同盟 （Shark Allies）。佢哋喺上年指出，假設全世界每人接種一次新冠疫苗，而當中助劑嘅成分採用鯊魚角鯊烯，以每劑疫苗同樣含有十毫克嘅角鯊烯嚟計算，估計將需要宰殺大約二十五萬條鯊魚嚟滿足疫苗供應量。唔通人類抗疫嘅盡頭就係鯊魚浩劫嘅開始？ We have been researching the use of shark squalene in、um, vaccines, particularly for the development of a vaccine for COVID-19. And、uh, while we researched that, well, we actually started out by researching cosmetics use, and then realized that it is also being used in、uh, vaccines, and that it has a history of being used for flu vaccines. And then, of course, that it potentially would be used in the future. So, with a pandemic,、um, it is worldwide. It's it's billions of people. So the use of an ingredient becomes more of an, an issue. And we believe it's something that we can address now before it becomes a really big problem, because、um, sustainability in the future means we should use something that is not taken from a wild animal. Because it's a limited resource. 喺唔少电视情节中，鲨鱼嘅出现通常俾人一种危机逼近嘅感觉。但喺现实生活中，为咗达到不同嘅使用目的，人类常年杀戮鲨鱼，例如用鲨鱼鳍嚟制作鱼翅供人类食用，又会喺护肤品内加添角鲨烷，提高油润同调理嘅功效。而喺疫苗助剂中加添角鲨烯，亦唔系新鲜事。The role of an adjuvant. Is to cause a local inflammation at the place where you inject. When that happens, then the body looks at that as a site of injury, and it starts its own immune response. It starts marshaling the white blood cells to there, and it starts producing antibodies. So the role of the squalene is to cause that local effect to stimulate the body's、uh, immune response. But it can, there are many, many materials that will do that. It just seems that you know, for many vaccines, squalene is is a good one because you need very little of it to to do this、uh, effect. 对于大规模制作疫苗会唔会造成更多鲨鱼牺牲呢个问题 ，Dr. Schwartz 提到需要考虑两点。第一，宰杀一条鲨鱼未必一定只为提取角鲨烯。有可能係喺現有用嚟宰殺作其他用途嘅鯊魚中提取。第二，藥廠係咪確定會使用鯊魚角鯊烯嚟製作疫苗助劑呢？市面上仲有其他材料可以被考慮用嚟製作疫苗助劑，例如鋁鹽。鋁鹽比角鯊烯早超過半個世紀之前已經開始被廣泛用作疫苗助劑。而 Stephanie 亦解釋，佢哋之所以喺呢個時候發聲，並唔係想阻礙疫苗研發嘅進度。So the goal can be sustainability, protecting sharks, and creating a vaccine everyone can get that is reliable for many many years to come. If we can create a secure 
a supply chain, you know, something that you can actually reproduce and grow and control instead of taking from a wild animal, we can assure that, that everyone can get the vaccine and the best version with the adjuvant. The testing of alternative uh, squalene has to start alongside with the shark squalene so they can say we can use either or. If it is a little more expensive to extract right now, that's because it's not being as mass produced. You know, like everything else, once it's being mass produced, the, the price will drop and it'll be the same or cheaper than, than shark oil. Especially once shark oil gets more rare, it'll become more expensive. Goxahi 所以海洋生物的保育工作一直是人类生活中不可忽视的项目。鲨鱼保育组织大力呼吁，希望药厂喺制作疫苗嘅同时，当研发其他可以提取国鲨鱼嘅方法，寻求一个可持续嘅选择